Good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you? I'm well. How about you? I'm okay, thank you. So what happened with that uh, survey you sent today? In what way did you see? Okay. Yeah. I was meeting 20 people, so now I have 25 people that were completing the survey. Okay, and and you study you brought you study English or or excuse me. You study English in the university or or something? Uh, yes, at the university. Oh, okay, good. I am here at the university of Salvador. Oh, okay. Cool. Let's wait for everybody to jump in. Hold on, I can't find my Ethernet. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. So, how was your day? My day was okay today. Oh, cool. I, I am reading that there's another storm coming. Really? Yeah. Yeah, there's another storm coming to El Salvador. How was your day today? A little bit busy, but it was okay. What do you do in the day? You, I mean, you study online. Yeah, I was receiving classes. Okay. So you don't you don't go out, you stay in your house all day. Yes. That's cool. I stay the whole day in front of the computer. Enjoy. <laughs> because when you start working, oh man, those days will never come back. Yeah, that's true, but it's different in because in this case, you're in front of the computer, but you're this time generating money, earning money. In my case, no. <laughs> <laughs> and receiving work in homework. Oh, okay. Hold on, let me see one thing. So do you work see. in a call right? I'm sorry? Do you work in a call right? Yes, I do. I work in Telus. That's true. I have I, I can't hear you that good. I I'm I'm checking my volume. But um maybe it's my microphone because Okay there, I can hear you better now. Okay. Yes, I work in Google. Ah. I the red face. Guys. Hello. Hello. Hi. I'm How are you, people? How are you? Fine. Cool. Thank you. How is life treating you? Good because today is Friday. Oh yeah. Today's Friday, but I remember my Fridays before, but now they're different. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my Friday before I was a father, and now that I'm a father, it's very different. Yeah. Like a mother, too. Yeah. Like but I mother. love, I love this Friday. So. Mm -hmm. No, you know, I think it's good. I think that, you know, because of my son, I I stop. I I I didn't stop going out. I don't go out. I always stay home. 
I prefer to stay with my son. And it's good because I save money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I prefer to play with my son. Mm -hmm. so he will have How money for the he? university. Oh. Yeah. How old is he? He is four. Ah, four. He's four, yes. Mm. Good evening, everyone. Sorry All right. No. Good evening. Now everybody's getting connected, I see. We have Mr. White, Alex White. Yeah. All right. So remember, we were practicing yesterday the infinitives. Hello, hello. Hello, welcome. Uh oh, hold on. I'm going to share my screen with you right now. So we can do the next. Okay. So we can do the next. Okay. Tell me if you see my screen, please. Not yet, teacher. Okay, what about now? It's loading. Yeah. Yeah, you should see it now. Of course. Okay, good. Thank you. Um, I was telling, I was reading today that um, we might, I'm sorry, Hybrid, what is your name? I always forget. Alex, my name is Alex. Alex, there you go. Hmm. Okay, thank you. <laughs> because hybrid, I like that though. Oh no, it's hybrid. Yeah, hybrid. Yeah, oh my God. You see, I told you I need glasses. I read hybrid. I was, you know, that's not spelled correct. <laughs> but okay, it's hybrid. Not really, that happens. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I was, um, I was telling Alex that I read that there's another storm coming to El Salvador, huh? Yeah, but he's going to rain. Yota. Yeah, man, that's crazy. Yeah, imagine. Weird names, right? Do you know Do you know how the names are, are put? Who puts the name? Oh, no, no, I, I, I don't know this information. Um, but, uh, the person that discovers it, they name it. Really exist yeah. person like this name? Yeah. Yota. Yota. Maybe it's their dog's name or something. You know, gringos are very attached to their animals. <laughs> really? That yeah. word in that way? Yeah, whoever discovers, like whoever discovers the comet, you can name them. Oh. What is it like Comet Haley and I thought that they have a list, but <laughs> That is strange if you discover it and you name it. If I ever discover a, a, a storm or or a comet, I will name it Bowie. Bowie is a good name. But yeah, because, about because what? Of, because of David Bowie. I oh. love David Bowie. So then the mm -hmm. comet is going to be Bowie. Yes, but imagine if you're working in that place and you say, oh, in this year I put the name 20 storm, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. It's, uh, it's the ar archive, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Gio, welcome. Hey, thank you. All right. Okay, let's do the video, please. Uh, I'm gonna put the video, tell me if you have any questions. Let's go. This time we'll come up with infinitive clauses and phrases to come up with solutions. Pay attention and take notes. Infinitive clauses and phrases. Oh man, we did this One thing to I do think. about it is to talk to the company's management. Another way to stop them is to get a TV station to run a story. The best ways to fight HIV AIDS are to do more research and educate people. 
Let's go back and notice the expressions used on the grammar box. One thing, another way, the best ways. With these expressions, we must continue using one way plus infinitive plus is or are plus infinitive. For example, one way to help the homeless is to build more public housing. Now that you have learned to give solutions, can you think of two more for these problems? Remember to do it on our discussion box. Okay, um, let me do something here. Okay, here we have one thing, another way, and the best way. Obviously, the best way you can say also the worst way. Yes? Tell me what, uh, okay, so after that, one thing, two, and then you put the verb. Yes? One way to eat pupusas is with your fingers. And another way to eat pupusas is with your fingers. I'm sorry, but pupusas are only with your fingers. But okay, another way to eat pupusas is with fork. It's with the form of tacos. Oh yeah, but always with your fingers. <laughs> yeah. One way to drink coffee is black, and another way to drink coffee is with sugar. With milk. Like a Starbucks. Yeah, like Starbucks with. Oh, another way to drink coffee is with cold, ice cold. Ice cold coffee, yes. Mm -hmm. And then we have the best way. And the best way to drink coffee is black. With not sugar. Or may, okay, maybe sugar is a little passive, but that's <laughs> it. No cream, no, no nothing. <laughs> All right, give me an example with one thing to Marvin. Let me see um, infinity clauses in Facebook. Uh, okay, uh, recommend me one thing to watch in, in Netflix. Ah, okay. Um, so I recommend you one thing to, to watch uh, on Netflix about uh, nature is a new episode of uh, uh, Lion's Life. Something. The Lion's Life. Yeah, I think it's a invented name, bro. <laughs> Only for it. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, it doesn't exist, right? Then, so. Okay. Yeah. But, but with Netflix, you don't need to invent. There's a million things. <laughs> yeah, but I, I sometimes I have time and sometimes I don't have a book. To yeah. watch do, do you have a problem with Netflix that sometimes you don't know what to watch and you spend one hour yes, yes, browsing? It's a, maybe a, a short, um, short um, a specific, I don't know, new movies, they don't change and maybe they are a problem right now because uh, Disney Channel uh, have a more <clears throat> like a, cartoons and something like that and another uh, platform about this yeah 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 but me sometimes i spend like one hour just browsing <clears throat> in netflix and not watching anything <laughs> i recently yeah. i recently watched gambit queen the gambit queen uh, uh, what, uh, what about that it's okay Did not to Oh. I wouldn't recommend it, but it's okay. No. Oh. So okay, so that's one one thing to watch right now in um in Netflix. Okay, good. Okay, thank you. Uh, one way, or um, let me see, Elena, which is the best way to travel or to go to San Miguel? The best way to travel to San Miguel is. Or the I best car. road, the best road to take. What? Okay. By car. By car. Okay. 
Yeah, the best way to travel to San Miguel is by car. Actually, you know, for me, the best way to travel to San Miguel may be going to super special buses. Um, they are nice. Yeah. With a movie, right? With movie air conditioning, mm -hmm. it's like you're in an airplane. <laughs> like. uh, if you have uh, enough time, it's, it's the best way. Yeah, but well, it's two hours. Two. I think three hours. Well, maybe now, but I remember before I frequently, I frequently traveled <laughs> to San Miguel, and it was nice. The bus. The ugly part was la la terminal. That's ugly, but the rest is okay. <laughs> Hello, Alexandra. Hi, teacher. You work in the bank, right? Which um, what which branch which what which branch uh, Bank of America. yeah but which one which branch because there are many which branch? like the the one in escalon sucursal exactly oh. thank you so, thank you oh you're welcome uh, <laughs> Oh, uh, I am in the Salsa Prosa office. Salsa Prosa? Okay, I can't hear you very good, Alexandra. I work in the Salsa Prosa's office. Okay, and where is that? In Santa Elena? At Colonia Loma Linda. Okay. In okay. San Benito. Okay, Lomali. Oh, okay, cool. And where do you live? I live in Lourdes. Okay, so which is the best route to take from your house to your job? The best route. Do you travel is... by, I'm sorry, do you travel by car or bus? I drive. Uh, the bank gave us transportation oh they give you transportation oh that's good the best way to to travel to my office is taking the monsignor romero street freeway freeway sorry no very good very no it's okay don't say sorry you say sorry too much <laughs> it's okay <laughs> don't worry Okay. Um, <laughs> Patricia. Hi, teacher. Hi. Can you tell me which is the best way mm. to make rice? To make rice, the best way, it depends, like, uh, uh, how you, you want to eat, but the best way is uh, in uh, uh, white rice. Uh, the best way to make, okay, so the best way to make rice is white. The, the best ways, the best ways to make rice is. Uh, make it white. white make a white uh -huh, without salt and just only with water. Okay, good. I love white rice. I, oh man, with soy sauce. Oh, <laughs> it's excellent. It's really good. It's really, really good. Gio. <laughs> Gio, you're a music lover, hey. correct? Um, it depends. But yeah. <laughs> you don't like music? Yeah. Okay, which is the best? Well, you live with your family, so now which is the best way to listen to music? Uh, with the earphones. Yeah. Can yeah, you say it completely? The yeah, the best way to listen to music in my house is with earphones. Earphones. Yes, it's true. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I do now, because now if I if I listen to the music too loud, <laughs> lower the volume. That's too loud. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah, and that's for everything. If I want to play, I have to put earphones. If I want to play guitar, I have to play 
with earphones. <laughs> Everything has to to be done with earphones. Yes, it's true. Rice with beans, Alvin? Yeah. There are a place in Super Selectos. Uh, if you want to eat in Super Selectos, you go and buy your own uh, meal. Meal. Oh, like a cafeteria. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, 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 I frequently go there. Wow. Before the pandemic. It's very cheap. Exactly. And... Uh, tasty. Yeah, because um, I I if work. In... To, if you if you don't want to cook, that is the the way. <laughs> oh yes, definitely. It's like two eggs, rice. I'm sorry, two eggs, beans, coffee, cheese, and bread. It's like one seventy five or something. I don't know. I never saw the prices, but. I know it's cheaper. <laughs> no, it is. I, I, I frequently I, I frequently used to go before the pandemia because I work in Las Cascadas and that's where the um super the supermarket is. I was thinking that the rice with beans, it was a can, a can you can buy in the super selectors. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought too. That's what mm -hmm. I thought too. I was really right. <laughs> This moment was Yo, mi casamiento. <laughs> okay. Oh man, what, what happened to my mouse? Okay. All right, so let's continue with this. Let me see next. So one way to reduce famine is, you know what famine is, correct? Yep. Yeah. Ambruna? Yes. Um, I think, well, El Salvador has always had famine, but like well, a country that really, really had famine in history was Ireland, England. In the end of the century nine, yes. Uh, 19. Yes, Ireland why, had a famine. That, that's why in the United States, uh, have uh, too many Ireland people Irish. because uh, Irish, Irish people, exactly. Yes, because of the famine. Okay, so uh, Carla, one way to reduce famine is? Is one way to reduce famine is? Uh, Can you read all of them and then tell me which one do you think is the correct one? Okay, one way to re reduce famine is to build more public housing to train people in modern farming methods, to start free vocational training programs, to educate people on the streets, to provide ways for people to voice their concerns, to develop cleaner public transportation. For me, one way to reduce famine is eh, to build more public housing but remember famine has to do with hungry not population people who are hungry oh and i like how you read this to educate people on <laughs> on the streets <laughs> i like that it was an accident or you did it on purpose because it was an accident okay but, but that's still it's, bad, it, right so this look. one also here, look, mother. Mother. They forgot modern. Mother. <laughs> mother. Mother, do you think they'll drop the bomb? Pink Floyd. Uh -huh. Oh my god, it's Friday. Really it's Friday. Really Gio, have really you heard have you heard Sinead O'Connor sing that song? Mother? No. no. Look for it live. Yeah. I think it was in, in the wall with Roger Waters. He had he had special guests. Oh, listen, really? listen to Sinead O'Connor sing that song live with Roger right. Waters. Oh man. My respects. Yeah. Sinead O'Connor. I'm sorry? Sinead O'Connor. Sinead O'Connor, yes. Ah, the, the singer the ball, who the ball uh, girl. Uh, yes. uh, destroyed the, the 
the pop photography the in pop front photography. of him in yeah. Saturday Night Live. Yeah. Yeah. That was cool. <laughs> that was cool. Yeah. I mean, that, that was brave. Yeah, I like, yeah. So, Carla. It's, it's it for her because that, uh, that why the, no, that's why her career uh, going to down, going down. Yeah, yeah also, true. but also she didn't have that many good songs after that, really. There's a new singer in this moment. Her name is LP. She's good. Listen to her. I like her. So, Carla, so what do you think? Is to build more public housing then? Yes. Cool. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Does anyone else think differently? Um, mm. To train people. Maybe sounds sort of difficult. Train people in motor farming methods. To train people. Train people, maybe. To train people. Train people in motor farming methods. Well, you know, you know, yeah, go ahead, Carla. Carla, you were going to say something. Yeah, Carla's right. I mean, there's more than one answer correct. But, okay, let's do this because famine has to do with food. And so this is the most logical, right? To train people in modern farming methods. Maybe yeah. because if you have farming, you have food. Yeah. Or produce more food. Yes. One way for me, one way to reduce famine is to stop reproducing. <laughs> <laughs> to stop reproducing. So the churches, yeah, the church should give sex education, but they never will. So, yeah, but that's one. Way. But let's see if that's correct. Okay, next, uh, Carla, can you choose someone for number two, please? Marvin Josué. All right, Marvin. Just wait to fight. Yes. So can, can you read number two, please, and then the examples? Yes. The best, the best way to fight the HIV is... HIV. Yeah, HIV, yes. Or AIDS. Mm, or AIDS. Ah, oh, it's a short train. Is mm, maybe provide way for people to voice their concern. I to provide that. ways for people to voice their concerns, okay? To educate people on the street. Or start a, yeah. You think it's to educate people on the street? Yes. Okay, Marvin, what do you the, think? The, the platform is... <laughs> you say that. <laughs> Yeah, no, that is that is that is uh, true. I don't know, but the platform is the correct answer. <laughs> I don't know for answer. me. Yes, <laughs> yes. Uh, but, but 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 me, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, well, it's, 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 maybe it's, other ways, right? <laughs> yes, but it's logical, you know. That, you know. Yeah, it's logical yeah. because I think that they, they they think about give maybe condoms or pills yes. or. You know, recently I watched a very, very good movie. Please, I recommend you that movie. It's extremely good. It's Dallas Buyers Club. It's good. I love it. Man, that movie is awesome. Matthew McConaughey and Jared Leto. What an excellent acting, man. It's about maybe AIDS. The, maybe the problem with this uh, answer it's because it sounds like uh, you go in a pickup with a, with a, a, I don't know what is the name for this the thing, but like la papa, la papa, la papa, la papa, la papa, la papa. The, the <laughs> you, megaphone? You, exactly. Uh, because you have to educate people <laughs> on the street with that uh, megaphone in, in your car in the streets. Uh, Literally yeah. on the streets. <laughs> it's yeah. true. It's it's true. true. It's true. One way to stop political unrest is. All right. Um, okay. Uh, Alvin, can you choose someone else, please? Uh, okay. Um, 
In this case, a, a lady. I, let's choose a, a lady. lady. Oh, yes, of course, of course. Uh, let me see. Gloria Navarro. Why not? All right, Gloria, G L O R A, Gloria. Gloria. Okay. Mm. Um, one way to stop political unrest is, I think, to provide ways for people to voice their concerns. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's that's logical. Can you choose somebody else, Gloria? Somebody with, with beard. Uh, Carlos Flores. Next. Hey, um, I'm really sorry, but I am getting it right now and I um I am a little lost. But if you repeat me the question, maybe I can give you an answer. Uh yeah, can you read number four? And Try to make the best of it. Okay, one thing to improve air quality is air. Hmm. Ah, okay. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. To do more traffic. To educate people on the street. Mm -hmm. To educate people on the streets to provide ways for people to voice their concern. Yeah, I, I, I'm not sure the, uh, if the question is uh, one thing to improve air quality is, uh, but I think um, to provide, uh, to educate people on this on the street could be because for for example people who, pe people who smoke maybe okay. can yeah but the problem is that this one is taken this one is taken with the aids so maybe this one is good to, to develop cleaner public transportation because you know like the buses in El Salvador man that smog yeah the traffic jam product smoke and air contamination yes I agree. okay all right cool uh oh sorry and uh, number five ronnie what's number five hi uh, the best way to reduce poverty is is to start free vocational training programs. Okay. Very nice. Yes. Okay. And number six. Elena, can you tell me number six, please? The number six, one thing to help the homeless. One thing to help the homeless. Uh, okay, let me check. My thing is the first to build more public housing. Okay, good. Very nice. And let's see, people, did we pass? Are we okay? Are we cool? We cool, we cool, we're cool. We're good. Here's another example. Who, who in this class is single? Who is single? Carla is single? Yes. Carlos is single? Me. Ruth is single. All right. He will raise his hands. Cool. Hey, Gio, looking so much. <laughs> Gio, you're single too? Mm -hmm. You're single? Uh, yeah, when I'm out of my home. <laughs> <laughs> you're <Yeah>, looking. <laughs> you know. 
casa casado. Yes. <laughs> okay, Ruth. Ruth, let me see. You're single, right? So what is one way to win your heart? Ma win, win what? This is, this is like a saying, you know, like I, I tell people, man, one way to win my heart is give me chocolate. Oh. And you win. <laughs> so what is one way to win your heart? Just be nice with me. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. So, so, uh, so you have to say that one way to win my heart is to be a gentleman. One way, one way to win my heart is nice with me or gentleman. I'll be a gentleman. All right. All right, Carla, what is one way to win your heart? Uh, the best way is being smart. Uh, but can you answer complete, please? Because what I want to hear is one way to. <clears throat> one way of win my heart is. One way to. One way to win my heart is to be smart and be different. <laughs> and be different. All right. Be spontaneous. Be spontaneous. Like, first, we have to be friends. And okay, good. Just uh, into his business. Know each other. Yeah, first you have to know each other. Okay, that's 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 fair. That's good. Carlos, what is one way to win your heart? Carlos Flores? Yeah, Carlos Flores. Okay. Please uh, don't say you have to love me. Oh, come on. <laughs> 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 yeah, but uh, similar that people who say um, uh, smart people, yeah, smart people and justice people, yeah, is for me very interesting. Yeah. Okay, it's but can you please Spanish, say one way to Spanish, win my heart? In Spanish, ha, in, in Spanish, it has a name. Um, it is tapie um, sexual. Tapie sexual. Oh my God, that one's new. What is tapia <laughs> sexual? Yeah, in Spanish is people um, because I, I can I can get interested with someone else, uh, not for the uh, 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 appearance, not for the gender. Appearance. Very smart, smart people. You know? that, no por el género, not for the gender. Yeah, no, yeah, not for gender, not for um, as aspect things of smart people <laughs> okay good okay i see the step really step your sexual i thought it was another name sexual, i uh, agree with with carlos tapia sexual. okay tapia so sexual one sounds like somebody who loves the uh, tilapia or something like that <laughs> <laughs> yes i think about it yeah no yeah that, that one, no i i heard about that one of my best friends he is um he is gay and he told me that it's, it's a trend. It, well, it's not a trend. It's, it's something new. That people now, it's not the gender. Mm -hmm. It's the interesting part. Mm -hmm. Correct? So yeah. so for you, okay. So so for one way to win your heart is to be interesting, Carlos. Could you repeat it? So Question basically again? for you, one way to when your heart is to be interesting. Yeah. Smart and interesting. Okay, good. Because you're interested in the person, not the sex, not the gender. Could be. Yeah, it's not okay. important. Okay, yeah, cool. Could cool. be attracted by people, maybe men, women. Yeah. Um, it, 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 it depends on maybe the moment and the, the good, re good relationship, good interaction. Yeah, perfect. Something. I understand. Okay, cool. Nice. Interesting. One way to win my heart is don't tell my wife. <laughs> don't tell my wife, and we're perfect. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I hope she's not listening. Okay, now let's read. Let's have the next reading. It says the threat to Kiribati. 
It says, read the following article, try to understand it as you read it. Take notes on new vocabulary. This is just for you to practice reading. So let me see how many paragraphs do we have here? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let me see. All right, let's do one thing. Gio, can you read the first paragraph, please? And when you finish, you pick the next person. Hello? Gio, can you read the first paragraph, please? I don't know, I'm gonna say. Let me think. Yes. <laughs> the people, <clears throat> the people of Kiribati pronounce Kiribati are afraid that one day in the near future their country will disappear, literally. Several times in the past few years, the Pacific Island na nation has been flooded by sudden high tides. These tides, which swept across the island, and destroyed houses came when, when there was neither wind nor, nor rain. The older citizen of Kiruba, 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 Kiruba. The older citizen of, of Kiruba say this has never happened before. All right, good. Um, that's. The vocabulary is understandable, correct? Yeah. No yeah. questions? Cuba. You understand tides, tide, right? What mean tides? The tide is uh, high and I'm tides. moving on. But you're sort of I want to be your... Tide... You, no, no, tide Maria. is... No, if you surf, you need good tides. Yeah, olas. Yes. Yes. Olas. Well, actually, no. I'm sorry. Olas on waves. Tide is marea. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. Has been flooded by certain high tides. I can't present the canción de. Remember the tide is high and I'm moving on. Flooded. What is flooded? Flooded. When it rains a lot, for example, with this, with this eta. With yes. Yeah, remember how, with ETA, how do you say flood? Flood. 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 Mm -hmm. flood. Yes. And in past, it's flooded. Ah, flooded. Thank you. Oh, man. One, one day, well, a long time ago, the pipes of my house, they broke. La pipas and the and when I woke up in the morning, my complete house was flooded. Like that's so horrible when that happens because they have to break everything. Yeah. Okay, Gio. That happened in Colonia Santa Lucia. Oh yeah, that happened in every my winter. house every winter. Oh man, you have winter in Santa Lucia. Santa Lucia is a, is a neighbor in near from Soyapango. But you have winter, so you have winter in Soyapango? Yeah. <laughs> in fact, in El Salvador, there are only winter and summer. Yeah. Well, well, you know, actually, yes. But remember, we are a tropical country. So technically, in El Salvador, we only have dry and wet season. Technically speaking. The dry right? for us is summer. Exactly. In the in the wet, is... yeah, but remember, because when, if you say winter to a gringo, if they say, oh my God, in December is winter, they will think 
like, oh my God, I need jackets and I need chimney and I need, you know, they think extremely cold. And, and then you have to explain to them, no, it's not, it's not winter. It's just the it's only time the of winter. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's actually the only time of the year that is actually chilly, not cold, chilly. Come on, like, ooh, it's nice today, but it's not winter. <laughs> yeah. Because remember, uh, well, people from Europe or United States, if you tell them it's winter, they'll take it seriously. Porque los pobres, cuando winter, they lo asimilan con winter. Yeah. So actually, really the monsoon time. Yeah. So um, actually, in tropical countries, you only have wet and dry season. Yeah. Okay, um, Gio, pick someone else, please, to read the second paragraph, sir. Gio. I'm searching my victim. Hmm. Hello, Gio. Who is the next? Who's been quiet today? Ruth Castro. All right, Ruth. Ruth Castro. The single lady. Oh, the single lady. The single <laughs> lady. Yes. You're up. <laughs> 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 I am sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you're sleeping on a Friday night. Yes, you are single. Yes. Um, get it. Kiruba. Yeah. Uh, are you? Kiruba is actually the pronunciation. Kiruba. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kiruba is the is for Iceland. Islands. Island is Karen across three thousand eighty fifty hundred three thousand eight hundred sixty kilometers. Oh, wow, two thousand forty no, four four hundred miles of the Pacific Ocean. Near the equator? Pacific Ocean. Huh? Pacific, Pacific Ocean. Pacific Ocean. O P. Near, near the equator? They are particularly affected uh, by high tides because no one of the islands of Kiribati, I don't know, mm -hmm. rises more than two meters. Six five feet. Huh? Six point five feet. Six point five feet. Above sea level. Okay. Okay. Sobre el nivel del mar. Yeah, above sea level. Okay. <laughs> Did you understand this? Does anybody have any question for vocabulary? Um scatter. Yeah, it's scatter. scatter. When you play dominoes, do you play dominoes? Yes. When you scatter the, the pieces? Oh, okay. the, mm. Revolver. <laughs> Revolver. <laughs> yeah, you scatter. So that's what it's saying here. The islands scatter across. So they're like spread. So in no particularly, in no, part, in no particular, uh, order. Order. order, thank you, yeah. Ruth, who is the next, Rita? Ruth, yes, thank you, next. I don't know, let me see. Okay, Ruth, pick the ugliest person in the class. No, I'm joking, oh, no. I'm joking. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. No, I'm joking, I just wanted to see. Okay, next, is, no. Uh, okay. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah. I, pick the, pick the most see. beautiful. Well, no, that would have to be me. Um, mm -hmm. No, pick anyone. Ronnie Caballero. Ronnie, gentlemen. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ronnie, make yourself famous. 
<risa> Hazte famoso. Go Ronnie, go Ronnie, okay. get busy, go Ronnie. Can you hear me, Clary? <risa> Loud and clear, sir. Okay. What is causing this mysterious tide? The answer might be global warming. When fuels like oil and coal are burned, they release pollution that trap heat in the Earth's atmosphere. Raising atmosphere. Atmosphere. Raising temperatures, temperatures create more water by melting glacier and polar ice caps. Okay. Atmosphere. Repeat. Atmosphere. Atmosphere. Okay, say it in three syllables, and then say it in two, and then say it in one. Atmosphere. 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 And then you say it in two. Atmosphere. 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 And then atmosphere. 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 And then I think temperature. La otra. Temperature. 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 Okay. Supercalifragilistic expialidocious. Supercalifragilistic expialidocious. Big Bob bought a big. Okay, okay. ¿Quién puede decir el gran Bob compró un gran bate de béisbol? El gran bro compró un bate de béisbol. El gran Bobby, el gran Bob. Ah, gran Bob. El gran Bob compró un bate de béisbol. Un gran bate de béisbol. compró un gran bate de béisbol. But in English. Ah. Big Bob. Ah. Big Bob. Bob. Big Bob. Baseball. Big Bob. Big Bob. Bob. A big baseball bat. Big baseball bat. A big baseball bat. Big Bob. Bye. Bat. Bob. Big Bob bought a big baseball bat. Panamericano. I'm a scumbag. I remember that song. It's old. Okay, uh, Mr. Gentleman, can you continue, please, the, the next paragraph, because it's very short. Okay. Oh, not that short. Is it who? No, wait, yeah, another, let's go with the next person. person. I continue. Yeah. No, please, choose next somebody person. else, Ronnie. Please, okay, let me see. I'm the oldest, you say. I... <laughs> I think we have Patricia, I... we have Sandra, we have... Uh, Elena Alexander Hernandez. Alexandra. Hi. 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 The next read, please. <laughs> Which part are? Uh, I think. Scientists. Scientists say. Okay. Scientists say that if the trend continues, many countries will suffer. Bangladesh, for example, might lose one-fifth of its land. However, the coral island nation of the Pacific, like Kiribati, and Kiribati. the Marshall, Kiribati, and the Marshall Islands will face an even worse fate. They will be swallowed, swallowed by the sea. This will be everyone's loss. I can see, teacher, can you down a little bit? Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you. Uh, this will be everyone's last coral formation at home to more species than one other place on Earth. And any. Nice. What? South Pacific. So this is... This is what, like by, by Brazil? <laughs> or, or Oceania? Where is Kiribati? Oceania? 
near from Oceania because it is yeah. so Pacific. Yeah, so Pacific. <laughs> okay, but it's not near from, or you say it's near or from. It's near. To. No, just near. It's near, 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 near Oceania. Oceania. Near Oceania. All right, Alexandra, pick the last victim, please. Uh, okay. Um, who's missing? I um, think Patricia, Laura, um, Sandra. Sandra. Jorge Luis. Jorge Luis. Oh, yeah, I don't know card. who is Jorge Luis, but maybe him. <laughs> I can see him. George Luis. Okay, thank you. Oh. Jorge Luis Mendoza. Here we go. And we have Alex Hybrid. Um, hybrid. It's okay. Hybrid. All right. Okay. All right, Alex, shoot. Sure. I don't know if the connection is good in this moment. Can you hear me? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, we have the last paragraph, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. The people of this nation feel frustrated. The ocean on which their economy have always been based is suddenly threatening their existence. There are no easy answers. These nations don't have a lot of money, so they can afford expensive solutions like seawalls. And they have no control over pollutants, which are being released mainly by large industrially native countries. All they can do is hope, do is hope that these countries will take steps to reduce pollution and therefore global warming. Nice. Yeah. In my opinion, I think Australia should take them because Australia has doesn't have a big population. And it has a very, very big country. Feel frustrated. Territory. On which their economies have always been based is a sudden their existence. Yeah. Okay. Questions? Um, so, what do you think is the best thing to do here? So, basically, can you summarize what the story is about, Carla? <laughs> So imagine, Carla, imagine I tell you, oh, man, I don't want to do that reading. Can you tell me what it's about? It's about the problem. Uh, Kiribas. How, how with the flows with water. Uh, they have clothes and this is a problem for them. The islands uh, begin to disappear. Okay. Because of the floods. Is there what, are, are this, is there like a high tides or, or what? Is there raining? Is, is there a lot of rain or, or what? The problem I think is the global warming. Yes, I because think that too. because that makes the the polar uh, the, uh, the the ice of polar uh, the ice of Arctic are um, how do you say they're tiendo smelting smelt? melting melting okay. and that makes the rise of the the tides and the problem for Kiribati Kiribat is Kiribati. Um, they have the days counted. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, it says here, look, <laughs> rising temperatures create more water by melting glaciers and polar ice caps. Listen here is don't buy a, a house near near to the beach. Yeah, lesson here, do not go to the South Pacific. Uh, class, do you have any special plans for this weekend? Yes, we have. Okay. What are your plans, Gio? I'm going to... Yeah, be being happy. It's a good plan. Okay, that's good. Cool. I'm going to the beach. Yeah. You're going to the beach tomorrow? 
or tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow. All I have right. to prepare my christening of uh, of my daughter. The what? The christening. Bautism. Oh, the baptism. Mm -hmm. How old is she? Uh, ten months. Oh, you have a ten month. Oh, you have a baby. Good for you. Yeah, I yeah we baptized my son too, against my will, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> but we had yeah we baptized him. At least we got money, so that's good. <laughs> All right, anybody else has uh, special um, plans for this weekend? There's no movie theater. You know, I have not gone to the movies in maybe four or five years. I Ooh. download all my movies. That is sad. So sad. No, that is smart, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I used to teach. I used to teach in Cinemark, the the main office, and they. I used to teach the, the general manager and he told me that actually the business of the movie theaters is not the movie, it's the food. The food. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. But one thing I didn't know and I thought I thought it was the other way around, but it's not. Actually the movie theater buys the movie. Can you imagine that? So like um I don't know, the Matrix comes out, Cinemark has, Cinemark has to buy the Matrix, and the Matrix people say, okay, we'll sell you my movie and give me a percentage. Poof. Damn. I always thought, I always imagined that like Matrix, hey, here, show my movie and just give me a percentage. But yeah, no, every it's... studio have mm -hmm. a, their own contracts for that. Yeah. Sometimes it's percent, sometimes it's another thing. Yeah, so that's why. So that's why they, they charge a lot on food. But I remember what I used to do is I used to put like hamburgers in my socks. <laughs> <laughs> torta, that's ni, ni era, uh, little ones. No, ni eran hamburgers. It, it was tortas, man. <laughs> For stack. <laughs> no, but look, it was by my by my foot, and they were covered. So when the lights went out, I used to eat them. Okay, people. It's Mark. nine o'clock. Okay, people. Thank you it very much. You have a great weekend. <laughs> go party. Yeah, or you or too. Go, to, go party or go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bye bye. Thank okay. you very much. Bye, Have, a good Have a good bye everybody. To piano man. Piano Have man. a nice piano weekend. Is piano man. Today is piano man. Tomorrow will be piano man. Tomorrow night. <laughs> Tomorrow. Bye bye.